So, uh, do you still love your mother, Anne? Yeah, I fucking love my mum. <laughs> I was, I was just about to say it. <laughs> my mother's fucking awesome. Yeah. Your mum is pretty cool. I've never met her, but she made you. So. Ah, oh, that's cute. Yeah, that's Thank you. Cool. Yeah. Thank you. Yeah. She died. Yeah, I did. <laughs> Fucking, it's going on here. A first date question that you never ask. Oh my god. Right, in stars, during sex, should we get another girl in here? No, is the answer to that question. I mean, no, I'm going to leave that question there. Eh? I was going to say, uh, I say, who fucks on a first date? That's disgusting. I, um. Ah! Oh! Can't fuck! <laughs> Do you want me to install peanut too? Yeah. The man did, you know. Oh, do you... Oh, fuck off. <laughs> I'm a fucking dick. <laughs> Didn't fucking pick up on that. <laughs> Jesus Christ. <laughs> time. Fuck me. Oh, we got another nine minutes yet. <laughs> oh, sorry. I fucking love my mother. <laughs> Jesus Christ. It's just, it's just a way you're justifying it. <laughs> it's like a big thing though. Like, oh, he loves his mum. You love your mum. Like, it's, it's... Yeah, I fucking love my mother. Alright? <laughs> She's fucking awesome. I don't I, give a fuck. I'm just laughing at the way you're like. She's fucking laughing at me. Love my mum, alright? I love my mum. I know. I know, I love you, mum. I love you too, mum. Fuck her. You're a fucking liar. I... You're a fucking liar. I love my mum. You're a liar. You haven't got a mother. You were born on an alien planet or a sponge. <laughs> born you're... out of a spiteful all in the ground. <laughs> you were not. You were not real. <laughs> you were a figment of my imagination. <laughs> yeah, you can't be real. Sent the test. My love for my mother. Yeah. <laughs> it's just my love for living. <laughs> oh fucking hell, man! What are all these fucking? Stop it! Right, I'm gonna have another. I'm gonna ask you another deep question. All right. After, after this advert. After this advert for travel dating, your travel mates, find people on holiday. There's beautiful people out there. The girl on the advert's not very pretty. If you are the girl on the advert watching this uh, video for, by some strange weird force of nature, uh, I was only joking. You're all right, like, but uh, I wouldn't travel with you. I mean, you you got a selfie stick for one. Oh. Yeah, but 90% of the people with selfie sticks are dickheads. So I can't believe he just burnt me. How are you stood in and took it? That's what she said. He just... Yeah, I was about to use a line from Walking Dead. He just slid his dick down your throat and you thanked him for it. Like. Well, it's not that he's been rude. Shout out to Walking Dead there. Your show's still slowly going crap. I don't like Walking Dead. Well, Walking Dead don't like you, so... Well, I don't care. If a mook sways, does his mother make him wash his hands with soap? It's not really a deep question, is it? <laughs> you can't it's, see us, we haven't got a face cam. So, but Andrew just sat there and shook his head. No, just, I don't, I don't look spot. It was I wouldn't, I wouldn't ask any of these questions to a girl on, on any date. I wouldn't ask these questions to any person. To be honest, mate, I actually think this is a, this is a pretty good question though. Does, does the Little Mermaid wear an algae bra? It's oh. more of a play on words. Algebra, algae is spelled A L G E. So bra made of algae is algebra. <laughs> You'd have to text it so many I I don't like this app. <laughs> <laughs> I don't like this game. I don't like this app. It, it's it, it started off fun, but now it's got shit now, isn't it? Well, it's not. Uh, no, I, it, it was never good. <laughs> <laughs> I think that's the point I'm trying to make. <laughs> but turn it off. I'm playing what. I question the love for my own mother. <laughs> I ever question the love for your mother. That's what it is, isn't it? I know what not like that. <laughs> Think Game of Thrones. <laughs> I actually love my mother, as in she is my mum and I am her son. <laughs> not as in, ooh, mum. Ooh, uh, whatever. I'm digging a deeper hole. <laughs> Just put the fucking shovel down, but for fuck's sake. No, I won't. Oh, I'm going to dig no, it. I'm going to bury myself in it. Love I'm gonna, my mum. I do. Love my mum. 
The fuck, man? I love my mother. It's fine. Why are you making me feel bad about I'm it? Don't make me feel bad. I'm questioning my own you sanity. You fucking love your mother, man. It's fine. I will. Fuck you. Not you. Him. Not me. Should we have a look at this app called Girl Facts? Oh God. Yeah. Let's let's learn some facts about the women. This is a collection. That, so it's described as a collection of awesome facts about girls. Okay. Now, if you're a girl and any of these facts are wrong, like, comment, subscribe. I feel like I... If any of these, app, these um, facts are right, like, comment, subscribe. Oh, just in general. Right, like, here we go. Regardless of gender. Right, apparently, girls like, love to cuddle oh, a lot. What? They like to... Girls love to cuddle a lot. Should we have another fact? Girls like holding hands. A guy's girlfriend wants to be the one... An only hand that he wants to hold, even if you're in public. It means you're protecting it and you're proud of it. <coughs> Man fact. Yeah. If you hold your girl's hand in town, it stops her from going shopping. It is a meme. I saw it online. That's true, we know, it? Shout out to you, me lad. You know what's going on. Fuck it, Isabel. My girlfriend, Dan, and she stays on shopping. Yeah. So that, apparently, that's bollocks. Apparently so. Italian restaurants are the most popular place for a first date. This is an actual thing. Someone has sat down and written these facts into an app. Someone has spent time out of their day to write bullshit app facts on a phone that some dickhead like me and you has downloaded to talk about. Well, let's not add me and you into that. Let's add you, because you did download it. I had nothing to do with it. I've died again! Right, yeah, I didn't download it. This is not even a fact about women. The oldest love poem was actually written on clay on a clay tablet around 350 BD before the times of the Sumerians. A tablet? All the way back in. Fucking hell, I Is thought it Samsung and iPad? I was about to say. No, it's that, micro, it's that Microsoft thing that came out and nobody liked it. And then Apple did it three years later and it was the best thing ever. No one's ever seen anything like it before. Fuck off, Steve Jobs. Hashtag fuck Apple. Oh, yeah, you've got a thing about Steve Jobs, haven't you? The thing is, right, because Apple are just such a villain company. They are a villain They're company. like a big company that stick their fucking greasy little fingers in everything and get every fucking, oh, yeah, oh, we can't have that. It's Apple. Apple's only compatible with Apple things. Apple, Apple, Apple. And like, it, it wouldn't surprise me if Steve Jobs had come out and said, oh, by the way, you know, like Kevin Spacey, oh, triggered, in fucking advanced warfare. Oh, we're not making a DNA bomb. No, no, no. Because we've already made it. It wouldn't surprise me if Steve Jobs just came out one day, if he was still alive, and just gone, <laughs> Apple's not planning to take over the world and put chips in people's head and control all the media and everything like this and control everything in the world. Because we already have. Because I'd be like, fucking fuck Apple, like. The, 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 the fucking phones are shit, like. I don't, know that. I don't like them. I don't like them. I've never owned an iPhone. I like the iPods. I just can't work an iPhone, like. I've never owned them. Ah, uh, they are. Oh, for fuck's sake! Why is everything fucking Vincent killing me? Fuck. Truly, this is just a fact for people in general. When a girl is being serious, listen to her. Yeah, Surely, if a... anyone's being serious, you should listen to her. Yeah, apart from Donald Trump. Don't listen to him. Or no. Nigel Farage. Oh, that fucking clown. Or, um, or any news reader. Just don't watch the news. Find out facts on your own accord. Yeah, do some research. And don't be with the bullshit of, oh my god, something's gone wrong, outrage, yes. For a little bit. And then everyone seems to forget. Like, I bet they, they started mentioning the Greenfell Towers today. I bet every fucker forgot about that until today when they went on 71 people are dead. Now everyone's kicking off about it again. Yeah. Apart from the families and the people who are directly involved, people up in fucking North Manchester and shit like that who were nowhere near getting, oh, justice for London on their legs. I bet they am fucking, they've forgotten about it. Maybe. Maybe. I, I'm not touching that with a barge pole. No, I'm not touching that. <laughs> I'm, not, I'm not touching it any further than that. It was a horrendous tragedy and it should never have happened in the first place. But uh, No, I shouldn't have. Should not have. Here's an idea. It's just, it's just I don't know, Just, just, it's just upsetting seeing bad things happen all the time. Like this what is... Coming to you're going to fucking die fucking tragic turn. With the day dinner or whatever after this is. Question out. Led us to that. Apparently, happiness is contagious. Fucking isn't. It's not because every I time I see someone who's happy and I'm not, I hate them. <laughs> There's nothing more annoying in it yeah. than somebody being fucking happy when you ain't. Yeah. When someone's genuinely fucked you off and someone's here all smiles going, Oh, it's alright, cheer up. Oh, it's alright, fuck off. Yeah, just go away. I fucking hate it when people are happy and I'm angry. Fucks me off. Oh, for 
Fuck! Fucking fell on you all. Yeah, no, I hate that. Oh my god. Rattles. It's the ratas. The ratas. The cinco mertas. I don't know what that means. I don't know why you said that in like an old Spanish Arnold Schwarzenegger you think. As in a Spanish Arnold Schwarzenegger. Oh no! Oh no! That's right, you fucking leave me alone. You fucking... I'm going and I'm just running. I know there's a checkpoint up here where I can get the music box. Yeah, it's up that ladder there. I believe. I believe. Yes, it is because the, the story with the little girl is she gets eaten by the pig. Is she actually? Yeah, that's the um. So basically, you can it, like so they patched out apparently. I was reading, you know, the bit with the little girl she comes out of the house. Yeah. Um, it's in there. Oh, it's up in this lift. Uh, apparently, she uh the story is once you go back to her after Father Gascoigne and tell her to go to the church. No pig. Um, when you go through the sewer again where the pig is, mm. there's a blood stain on the floor and a message off her. Oh! Yeah, so she gets eaten. Oh, that makes sense. Well, hang on. This is fact as well. For anyone. It hurts girls to dump guys. Fucking hurts guys to dump girls. It hurts everyone. Everyone involved gets it. it. Yeah, yeah. Unless you've cheated on someone and you deserve everything you fucking get. Yeah. Why have I downloaded this app? I don't know. I honestly don't know. Now you... I've just added to the 100,000 people who've downloaded it. I want to read some of these positive things. It's a fake app, it's not working, it's totally rubbish. <laughs> yeah, well, that had positive feedback. You are really good and helpful. I remember some of these. Thanks. Well done, Adam Daruk. Let's name some names. Adam Daruk. Why are you downloading this? It's probably guys downloaded it thinking, oh, if I download an app like this, I can get girls to like me. No. Girls like you when you've got a bit of a fucking personality, you fucking spanner. I download this fucking... I, I'm back here now, so. Yeah, you've made a shortcut. Oh, hang on. That was it, Dan. Delete. Yeah, fucking get rid of girl facts. I know all them, anyway. <laughs> fucking, I'm the master of girls, says the divorcee. Do you know the only reason I got divorced was? I won the game and I fancied doing it again. So basically, I'm living New Game Plus. <laughs> More on his divorce than next episode. <laughs>